Welcome to another homework help video. In this video, you will learn how to calculate the number of employed workers given the labor force and number of unemployed workers. Before we dive into the calculations, let's define some key terms. The labor force is the total number of people who are either working or actively looking for work. It includes both the employed and the unemployed. The number of employed workers refers to those who have a job and are currently working. The number of unemployed workers represents those workers actively seeking employment but do not currently have a job. Now let's look at how to calculate the number of employed workers given the labor force and the number of unemployed workers. 1. Write the formula for calculating the labor force. The labor force equals the number of employed workers plus the number of unemployed workers. 2. From the problem statement, substitute the number of workers in the workforce into the formula. 3. From the problem statement, substitute the number of unemployed workers into the formula. 4. Subtract the number of unemployed workers from both sides of the equal sign. Now let's calculate the number of employed workers using the labor force and the number of unemployed workers using an example problem statement. The labor force in a country is 17.5 million workers and there are 10.5 million unemployed workers. Calculate the number of employed workers in the economy. First, write the formula for calculating the labor force. The labor force equals the number of employed workers plus the number of unemployed workers. Second, substitute the number of workers in the labor force into the formula. In this example, the labor force is 17.5 million workers. So let's substitute 17.5 million workers into the formula for the labor force. Third, substitute the number of unemployed workers into the formula. In this example, the number of unemployed workers is 10.5 million workers. So let's substitute 10.5 million workers into the formula for the unemployed workers. Fourth, subtract the number of unemployed workers from both sides of the equal sign. In this example, the number of unemployed workers is 10.5 million workers. So let's subtract 10.5 million workers from both sides of the equal sign, leaving zero unemployed workers on the right side of the equal sign and seven million unemployed workers on the left-hand sign of the equal sign. Congratulations! You have successfully learned how to calculate the number of employed workers based on the labor force and the number of unemployed workers. If you have any questions, comments, or suggestions, please put them in the comments section below. Until the next homework help video best wishes on your economic studies.